The Wake Forest Demon Deacons to close out this division. Dave Clawson, rocking and rolling, and and you know last year losing record four and five after the bowl game, but you know eight and five the year before that. Like four and five was pretty good last year considering all the stuff that they went through. It, FBI expects them to go seven and five. SP Plus expects them to go six and six. The win total is at six and a half. To go over is minus one forty. To go under is plus one ten. And this is one of those situations where. I'm going to trust the coach. Like you wouldn't think it just looking at the talent on the roster, but he always, he, he squeezes every ounce of potential out of his players. He's, he's got quarterback, Sam Hartman back. Um, You know, Clawson's offense is going to keep rolling. Like they've got explosive playmakers. He just finds these guys like under dirt piles, man. I I don't know where he pulls them Two stars across the board and they, they always play well on offense. Yes. Uh, defensive end Carlos Basham, uh, the only starter gone, like for them, he was a big piece, but it, it was not like a great defense by any stretch of the imagination. But he was a, a key piece of that. Uh, the team is well coached; they're not talented enough to be dominant, which means they're going to have like a ton of close games. But I expect them to win more of these coin flips than they lose. I'm going to go over that six and a half at minus one forty. Yeah, that's I, I really feel good about this one because I. I just I see this as a super well coached team, man, and their non conference games are not hard, like no. not hard. Like Army might be kind of difficult on the road, but like I still think they could win it. I was just about to say they're gonna have to win a couple of coin flip games for me to get to seven. Um, but I I think I can get them there. Like I think Clawson is good enough to do that. Yeah, you going over? No. <laughs> No, I'm going to go under. I, I, I like this team a lot. I do think six is the number. I think too many things have to go right for them to get to seven. Well, I mean, if, if you're going to have Ohio or Ohio State, if you're going to have Florida State as over, yeah. then you one of these you have to take. Is, yeah, at some point under. in time, yep. we got to be, yeah, yep. that's it. And yep. that's it. I just got them, I got them losing to two other, too many other teams, I think. That makes sense. That makes sense. Thanks for listening to the Winning Cures Everything podcast. The website is winningcureseverything.com, and if you want to connect with us, we're on Twitter, at GaryWCE, at ChrisBGiannini, at Winning Cures, or you can email us, Gary at winningcureseverything.com, or Chris at winningcureseverything.com. Subscribe everywhere you need to subscribe, and we'll see you soon.